Hello everybody, Zach here and welcome back to another GTA 5 mod showcase and a chase me, essentially. We're gonna get to that. Um, so this is a Kenworth 523 Bullnose from 1955. Beautiful truck, awesome uh, livery on both the truck and the trailer here. Uh, the trailer is a trailer, I guess that was used for like 19, from 1946 to 1955, I guess. Um, and it's got a weird, it's got a weird name. I, I don't know it off the top of my head. I'll be completely honest. Oh, there it is. A fru, a fruhof, like German. Well, it's most definitely likely German or German based. So really cool, really cool package here. I am not, however, going to use the trailer for more than a little bit of the video because it has some just annoying noise issues and then the camera isn't as far back as I would like. So we're gonna just drive this around and check it out as a mod, um, as a whole. And then we'll get into something like a chase me too. So kind of a dual purpose video here. So uh, this was also, I have to let you know, converted from a regular GTA 5 mod and put into here um, on 5M. So if there's anything wrong with it, I, I've said it before, I can't blame it on the model itself technically. And it may be an actual problem with uh, just the conversion, but I don't think there is really any problems. Like I said, other than that trailer doing what it does, I think we're good. Um, these don't pop up unless you give it a little, give it some revs and they're kind of like jankily animated again, though. I can't say that that's the fault of the, the mod itself and the trailer does some weird movement stuff too. But let's get into the first person here and check this thing out. This thing looks awesome in here and we got some awesome different uh, mods here. That I think is requirement to have the top on i don't know it comes in in the same same portion of the mod here but we're gonna get out here i cannot see anything in my mirror super legit gta style right we're gonna get on the highway here and i'm gonna go first person and we're gonna drive it around yes he kind of like clunks in the back there well, welcome to american truck simulator <laughs> now i think this is an awesome mod though and uh is it perfect? No, but it's really, really cool. And uh, like usual, eh, mods don't have to be perfect to have fun with them and, and to, to, to know that they're cool. I don't know what I'm trying to say there, but we're probably going to drop off this trailer pretty quick here because it's doing that funk thing. And uh, I don't know why. As well as, like I said, the oh, oh my God, we are smoking the band in it it already please stay in that turning lane because i'm going to take this exit oh smart car get the hell out of the way oh my god this trailer is just wobbly okay we're going to drop off the pepsi cola trailer here at the diner um what do you guys like more i, I definitely i think i said it in the video when i drove, drove the, the coca-cola truck i definitely prefer coca-cola oh we kind of came in hot there but you know, I get it. And uh, I have had, I have Pepsi every once in a while and I'm like, yeah, I don't hate this. Like, I think I still prefer Coke, but it's one of those things where just because you prefer something doesn't mean that the other thing is bad um, or that you hate the other thing either. So, all right, we're just gonna leave it here. They can handle it when they need to. What's the disconnect? Right there, perfect. All right, guys, let's take this thing because this is what you would do in it, right? You just, just drive it like that. Let's take this thing and get into a chase. If you haven't been here before, um, chase me. We just get stars. And that's it. <laughs> no, I mean, it is, but it isn't. Um, we try to have a lot of fun. And yes, is it down to kind of like uh, the same thing every time? Kind of, yeah. But uh, I still have fun doing it, and I hope you still enjoy it. If you're a regular watcher. Try to change it up sometimes. But we're going to go here. Go here. Whoops. I'm going to do some first person action here in this because this thing sounds so good. And it honestly doesn't doesn't have as bad of a, a problem with the FOV because you're in a big flat truck that just has a, a windshield up front. Oh, God. Turn, baby. Turn. She cannot turn. Oh, that was a bad wreck. Why did I think this thing would be able to turn on a dime? I do not know. Oh, that front end is just, well, not in great shape. But there's just something too. 
like don't get me wrong sorry coyote you ran across the street they always just try to run across the street and time it perfectly um oh no 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 oh i'm driving on top of them oh my god i gotta film that film that really um i'm not sure that i can get off of him kids look away this is inappropriate <laughs> Seriously, I can't believe we just rode his car for a good quarter of a mile or so. That's amazing. Um, there's something about old, you know, I think, I think a lot of people go, well, it was built better and, and stuff isn't built like it's used to. And then I think there is just a style thing, right? Or that stuff looked different than what it does now. And I think we just get, we're just like, we're, we're, we think stuff looks really cool not only because it's old and different, but because, well, it just stands out and it's unique. Um, stuff all looks the same right now, but you got to remember that cars all looked the same when they were around that same time period too, if that makes sense. So design language was in all the different cars and we thought that it, it only looks, I don't know. I don't know what I'm arguing for here. Can I actually, I don't know that I can fit. Coyote, God dang it. Oh, I can fit right down the center I could kind of fit on the sides too um I don't know what I'm <gasps> like I said I don't know what I'm arguing for or against here but is that the guy that I crushed no I don't think so right <laughs> it'd be pretty funny if that was still the car that I literally rode on top of for a good portion of the video or for a good portion of the I'm having a stroke for a good portion of <laughs> That one, oh, don't flip. Also, I love that the like chassis is painted the same as this. That's sick to me. That does look really cool. And the paint jobs, paint like used to look a lot cooler because we used to paint everything. You know, it wasn't just decals, nothing wrong with that. And I think decals are really cool. And I think they can really be cool and used uh, in a cool way, but you know, stuff when it was all hand painted there was some there was more of an art to it i think that's not discrediting anybody that does uh painting today or or does liveries uh, or you know decals today but all right we're gonna get into the military base i think this is a really bad idea considering how slow this thing is but i think if we kind of head right towards the um runway we'd be good famous last words right I don't see a tank. I don't see a tank. I don't see a tank. This thing cannot turn for crap. Oh my God. All right, I'm gonna repair. Get her. Oh, okay. Okay. All right. Don't know what that's about. I thought that might've been for me. Hello. How are you guys doing in here? How the hell is the military base doing today? Okay. I don't see any tanks. What's the, uh, what are the odds that I'm going to be able to get out of here in one piece? I can't even turn the damn thing. Okay. We got blinking too. I hear people. I don't hear tanks or see tanks though. Turn Zach, turn, go, go, go. Okay. Wow. That was way less eventful than I thought it would be. Uh, mind you, did I, you know, cheat by going on the wrong way and what have you? Yes. Okay, we're gonna go three stars. This is just is too easy, guys. This is too easy. Um, go towards the city. What do you guys think? I think I'm gonna flip around and go towards the city. Dang, this thing can really just lay it down. Okay, I say that as that motorcycle goes by me at a. Okay, so we did this in the last video, or not in the last video. We did this two videos ago. I'm going to mod the crap out of this thing because I need the speed. I'm going to put the uh, good old engine multiplier set to 32 still because spoilers, I recorded multiple videos around the same time. Look at this thing now. Okay, it's still not a speed demon, but did that take effect? Yeah, I think it did, right? Yeah, okay, it's still not a speed demon. Let's go to 64. There we go. 64 is going to do it. Oh, here we go. Don't make me mount you again. What do you guys think 128 yeah 128 that's yeah that's unrealistic i love it oh my god oh and i thought it could do drifts before look at that 
This thing's just laying down the rubber. Oh, was I? Oh, yeah, I was about to say. Was I wearing my seatbelt? Yes, I was. Oh, no. Bad accident. Oh, no. Oh, no. I lost my door. That's not good. That's not good from a defensive position. Okay, this thing can't turn, but it can drift. And you know what that means? Drift to turn. Drift to turn. Drift and turn. Drift and drift and drift. Oh, light them up, light them up, light them up. Let's get back on the highway. Oh, nice. Oh, no. There's an ammunition there? I didn't remember that there was an ammunition there, I'll be honest. Okay. What do you guys think this ends? I think it ends how most of my chase me's end. We end up surviving for way longer than expected. Uh, and then a freak thing, like, you know, only one or two like hits really does you in. Ooh, yikes. Big yikes. Oh, big yikes. I say big oof. Is big oof still a thing? Can you guys tell me? Cause I'm a boomer now. Can you guys tell me if big oof is a still a thing? I did join TikTok, by the way. <laughs> if you haven't already seen that, I joined TikTok. Feel really, uh, feel like a super boomer. Uh, but I feel a little less like a boomer being on TikTok. Don't understand it completely, but that's me. Um, I'm going to try to upload more and more stuff there. So if you haven't already followed me on there, that would be awesome if you could, if you would, if you could, and you should. Oh my gosh, this is just not going well. Watch out, guys. Oh, I just hit every one of them. Like they were bowling pins. Watch out. Watch out. Why is the horn take? It takes a second. <laughs> I wish you could hear or see when I'm pushing the button for the horn and realize that it's like delayed. Weird. And I'm hardwired right now too. So that's super weird. Okay. How do we get out of this? That's not good because there might have been... Oh, there were no spike strips? Weird. Oh, you're dead. See ya. Oh, we're doing 100... Okay, I, I was about to say, I need to do some first person in this. Doing 170 miles an hour in this thing. This thing would not have been able to do... Oh, what was it doing? 60? Was that... What is... 70? They're dead. I'm going to be dead here in a sec. We're rolling it. Sorry for the puke, because I know inevitably people are going to puke from that. Let's get out of here. The only way I know how. I'll say that's off-roading, so that wasn't it, but we would have just broke the entire transmission on this thing by doing that, but... Yeah, the fact that it's still just laying down rubber, and look at the back, look at the back tires and what they're... <laughs> look at that camber, though. That bull nose camber, if you will. Ooh. Oh, I mean, we got crazy camber up front too. Oh, smart car, don't do it. He's good. Man, I, I don't, I, I don't even have the drift button on because there's a drift button in the uh, menu, but I do not have that on. I wish I did because the fact that this game can drift the way it does with more power. Oh, here we go. That tree wasn't real. Is any of this real? What's real and what's fake? Oh, our clock is even dented. Seems legit. Oh, there's a uh, track down here. Here, let's try to get to that. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're good. Uh, there's a track down here. So let's try to get to that. I want to see what that's uh, like in this. I want to see if they can do it. And actually, honestly, let me know in the, the uh, comments what you guys think I should take on this track down here once we get to it. Um, it's a, uh, it's kind of a um, drift. I think it's supposed to be more of a drift track. That's indestructible. Well, you're going to see it here in a second. Anyway, so we get a better feel, feel for it. We're just going to drive right onto it. This is it. 
once I get here. Yep, so this is part of the track, so it just takes over portions of the dock, the docking uh, parking lot down here. And here we go, we're drifting on the track in this bull nose. Who would have thought that this is how this video inevitably would probably <laughs> end? I didn't. Oh, yeah, Helicam. Makes you sick, but it's kind of worth it. And then we just drift, drift a Rooney right into the hops. This is not going to end well. Okay, come on, guys. Come on, come on. Can you participate, please? We're shooting a modern day Smokey and the Bandit here. Oh, God, that helicopter's puke. Can we clear it? We can clear it. So that's the start finish. You kind of go right here and you just, those are indestructible, of course, because you got to make sure you got track limits. <laughs> Oh, this thing can't turn. We gotta drift more. We gotta put more power down it so we can drift the turns, make the thing turn with the drift. The wheel is like popping out of the, the cabin because it just can't do it. Oh, watch out, Beamer. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, these are some good views. Thank you for the cinematic cam GTA. Appreciate ya. Go, I'm going behind the thing. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, that's a good helicopter cam if that was technically a helicopter cam i don't know all right we're gonna go by the hot chihuahua meet here in a second oh okay so word word to the wise here it uh this doesn't make any sense to do this in a truck like this don't know why i thought it would be a good idea <laughs> and we race the bull nose we cannot <laughs> Can we drift the bull nose? <laughs> we cannot. Well, we can, but it doesn't end well. Okay. So what's going on with these red dots? Oh, they're probably security guards. And we can't leave that way either because of the damn things. Okay. We're going to figure out a way to get out of here, guys. I don't think we're going to have a problem. Just going through here. How do you exit this damn thing? Oh, look at these cars down here. What are these covered up cars? That's cool. I didn't even realize that those cars were just there like that. Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> no, no, no. Keep it. No, we didn't keep it, guys. We're dead. Swim, Zach, swim. Um, oh, there's thankfully a ladder right here. I think actually we're going to lose our stars. Now, mind you, it was only three, and we lost them in the worst way possible. Is there a damn car or something over here, or a bike, or anything? Or anybody that's driving, maybe? <gasps> oh, oh, oh. I need your car. I need your shoes. I need your leather jacket. I need, I need your motorcycle. Oh, shit, Except for your Albany cavalcade, and I just need that. Oh, yeah, because we got the super boost. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that was fun for Chase Me, and here we go with our ridiculous cavalcade now, and we're just going to get right onto the drift, get right to drifting it. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, I would love it if you could subscribe, like the video, hit that bell icon too if you want to get notified when new videos go live. I really do appreciate the support, and uh, yeah, if you can come over to Patreon slash uh, hit that YouTube button, that would be great. Either one of those really helps support me directly rather than just completely relying on ad rev. I would greatly appreciate that too. So until next time, guys, I'll see you later. Bye.